Tonight, CBS 17 is learning more about a Durham truck driver who stabbed and killed three women and wounded a fourth victim Tuesday in Tennessee. Idris Abdesalam was shot and killed by police at the scene. Tonight, we're learning more about his past. CBS 17's Crystal Price spoke with neighbors in this breaking news update. It's uh, shocking. It's surprising and un unthought of. Neighbors of 33-year-old Idris Abdu Salam, who live at the Republic Flats in Durham, are in disbelief. After hearing that he went on a stabbing rampage at this truck stop in Knoxville, Tennessee, Tuesday morning. I never thought this could happen with someone so close around me. Police say Salam walked into the Pilot Travel Center and stabbed and killed three women, 57-year-old Joyce Whaley, 51-year-old Patricia Nib, and 41-year-old Nettie Spencer. Spencer's cousin says she was full of life, loved her family, and was kind to everyone. And to have her life cut short like this is just unfair. It's just not fair. When police got there, Salam was in the parking lot holding a knife. When he refused to drop the weapon, police shot him. He died at the scene. Tonight, a motive is still not known. But this isn't Salam's first run-in with the law. I did some digging into his criminal history and found that he was arrested in Raleigh two years ago for eluding police. Salam was also charged with resisting a public officer in Orange County back in 2010. CBN 17 also uncovered that Salam worked as a correctional officer in Raleigh for the Department of Public Safety from August 2014 to May 2019. But a DPS spokesperson could not tell us why he left his position. In Durham, Crystal Price, CBS 17 News.